Hello everyone. I want to talk to you today a little bit about the importance of Instagram in terms of social media. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Ello, there's tons of them out there really, but there's a few that are really dominant. And Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram are the ones that are dominant. However, at the moment anyway, however, there's something special about Instagram for artists. And that's because it's an entirely visual medium. So I want to give you a few tips today just on how to use Instagram in order to benefit your art and get on the radar of other gallerists and artists. And I learned this technique by interviewing galleries all over the world and asking them how do they find artists. And oftentimes artists ask, how do I get on their radar? How do I get to, to know uh, that that gallery is looking at my work? Or And one way is sending them a link, of course, right? But it gives you one shot, you don't really know what they think. So, um, I mean, even if you follow up, it's, it's a yes or a no. However, Instagram offers a very rich terrain for finding galleries and having them look at your work. And it's simply done this way. If you follow this carefully, which is also outlined in the, in the course on social media, you, you really will see response. So what many galleries do now is they have an Instagram feed and they have an Instagram account, obviously, and they follow certain artists, they follow certain galleries, they follow certain collectors. So the reason they do that is because it's a quick way, one woman told me while she's brushing her teeth in the morning or, or doing anything else, she can just go through the feed and immediately see if she sees something visually that's interesting to her. So when you do that, it's, it's obviously a way for gallerists to get excited about work. The way to get on their feeds is simple. You begin by having an Instagram account and a feed, obviously, which just means that you're following a few people and you're posting your own images on there, not family and friends kind of imagery, but images of your art, just the art alone. Um, if there's a video of your art, you could put that up too, but you know, in Instagram, you should post ideally daily or at least three times a week. Then begin to follow other people. Follow galleries you're interested in, and you'll see who those galleries follow. There may be collectors on there. You can follow them too. Now that you have, let's say, I wouldn't follow hundreds of people at once, but let's say you're following 20 people or 30 people that are galleries, that are collectors. Now here's the really important part to get on their radar. Every day or every other day, whatever suits you, you could spend 15 or 20 minutes on this a day, Go to your feed, see who you're following, and notice what they've posted lately. You can like those posts, but this is even more important. Comment on their post. Write a sentence on the gallery's post about why that work is beautiful, why that's a particularly lovely piece by that artist, something like that. If you do this every day or a few days a week, if you comment on other people's posts, other gallerist posts, it's just human nature. They're going to wonder, who is this nice person commenting on my posts? And they're just going to click your name. They go right to your Instagram feed. And it's, it's really just human nature. They want to reciprocate if they can. So if they like your work, if it's interesting, they're going to click on it and say, I like it. Or they're going to make a comment. And you'll notice right away, this gallery liked my work. Or this gallery is now following me. The more you comment on other gallerists' work in a sensitive, intelligent way, not just saying, good work, nice, nice art, say something that's heartfelt about it, you will get a response. So again, today, this is really just the, the outline for a strategy of working with Instagram, because Instagram is a great way to, to attract galleries and to follow galleries and to have them follow you. Again, the takeaway from this is as you're following multiple galleries and, and perhaps collectors, and those collectors you're finding on the galleries you know, list as well of people they follow, um, if you're doing that, be sure to comment regularly. It's not enough to just like. If you use comments that are a sentence long or more, you will see action immediately on your website if you, if you do this regularly. So I look forward to hearing about um, how your Instagram feed is coming along and who you've attracted through this process.